Davis, and you're watching the Evercade Effect. Oh yeah, this is Ed from the Evercade Effect, and today we're going to play the games off the Street Fighter version of Evercade Alpha. So let me go ahead and explain how this works. I put up a card here if you want to see the previous video that I did uh, for the Mega Man Evercade Alpha, if you're interested in checking that out. So you'll be able to skip to the game that you want to go to down below, although if you stay till the end, you will be rewarded, and my viewers, long-time viewers know what I mean. So I'm not going to get an Evercade Alpha, I'm not going to pre-order it, just as the title says. This is strictly just covering the games. I'd like to go ahead and check out these games. Obviously, I've played some of the Street Fighters, haven't played them in a long time. If you're considering pre-ordering the Evercade Alpha, hopefully this can make a better decision for you. Uh, so without further ado, let's go ahead and we'll go ahead and start off with the first game, Fighter Championship Edition. So let's get, get that loaded up here. All right. And I should mention that I am playing just with the regular, you know, Xbox controller. I don't have an arcade stick, otherwise I'd use that. So let's go ahead and put in a credit, play some old school Street Fighter Championship Edition. I think I gotta stick with Ryu, right? I haven't remapped any buttons or anything. So again, I'm, I'm not comparing like the screen or using the physical aspects like the joystick, just, just the game itself. Oh good, my buttons are mapped the way I want them too. Man, it's been so long since I played old school Street Fighter. <laughs> it's not the first one, but I mean, it feels like it, right? And then we're gonna go and compare, you know, Alpha and all the rest of them, and just and just see, like, you know, kind of as I talked about, will I find myself coming back to playing the OG one now that we have like all the other, all the other versions out here? There we go. Oh, you can. Okay, so that's the, you know, that's the OG, that's the OG Street Fighter, Street Fighter Champion. I think, I think I have a good feel of that. Now let's go ahead and uh, we're going to switch on to the next game. So now we have Super Street Fighter 2. So let's check that out. <laughs> I love this beginning, it's so great. Ugh! All right, insert another coin here. All right. I guess for consistency's sake, I'll just be Ryu again. Back in the day, Ryu and Ken were my two mains because if somebody played you in the arcade, you knew you could pick the other one. Oh, wow. Yeah, this is already a lot faster. Oh, my God. Wonka <laughs> is such a... Buckle in the hat here. Yeah. Weak on the right side. No! Hey! Yeah. I assume a lot of you are um, left screened or whatever you want to call it. Like you're used to playing on the left hand side where the one player is. Oh, I definitely am. Oh, you can. Yeah. So, definitely. Yes, this is a lot. This is so much faster. <laughs> oh, I fell for that. Shame on me. Ah, maybe I'll get him this third round. Maybe I'll get him this third round. But yeah, this really feels like the same game as Champion Edition, just faster. And that's kind of what I remember. Throw your ass. You can. Oh, you can. Yeah. Definitely, um, yeah, definitely this, I would definitely see myself going back to this game here for sure. Um, there we go. I just wanted to switch up here. So I definitely could see going back, um, you know, and, and playing uh, this version of Street Fighter. I mean, it's a lot, um, it's a lot faster, right? And that's the Super Street Fighter 2 Turbo series kind of intended to be that it's much much faster championship edition was like the first street fighter 
but you know, you could you could play the bosses. So kind of that's what I was thinking. Like, I don't see myself going back to Championship Edition. I would much so far. I would much rather play, um, you know, the Super Street Fighter 2 Turbo. You know, let let me know in the comments below. Unless it's just something pure nostalgia, where you're like, yeah, I need to go back to that other <laughs> that other one. Uh, and the reason I bring this up is it's kind of like I consider this to be a duplicate of a game. May not be a popular opinion, but let's go. Let's go and continue. Um, Again, if you know Championship Edition was your favorite version of Street Fighter, I'm not taking away from that. I'm not saying this version is better. For me, it is. But if it's not better for you, that's definitely okay. So let's go ahead and move on to the next Street Fighter game. All right. So let's talk about Street Fighter Alpha. Definitely the Alphas are the least ones of the series I've played. I've played much more like Third Strike and all that. Um, so it's. I'm not saying I've been playing this for the first time. It's been a really, really long time that I've, that I've played this. Ah, that's right. Okay, we got these other cool people. Yeah. Let's take the Ryu. Manual. Yeah, Turbo on, sure. Yeah, it's, it's, it's been it's been forever. Actually, I remember yeah, I remember playing this on like Super Nintendo, which is pretty cool. So this is wow. This is this plays slower than hyper fighting. Interesting. Oh you can Ah! This controls a little bit... A little bit differently. Because some things feel like a little bit more floaty, but... K.O. No big deal, though, right? Round two, fight! I don't even know how to do, like, all, like, the... I'm just like randomly mashing buttons, like hoping to do like I don't even know how to do like the level two like like special moves and all that. Ooh, ooh, uh oh, I'm about to get on here. You know what? I want to say there was a was Alpha three on the Dreamcast. Okay, so I'm starting to. Hmm. Yeah, it's it's been a while playing this. You fought well. I was honored. Okay, let's do another. Let's do another battle. Uh, you know, I, I only played one round of the other Street Fighters because they're very, very similar, and I, and I played me a, a ton of Street Fighter Champion and Turbo. But yeah, I love like the graphics and all that, and the way that they're the way that they're drawn. You know, it's you know my preference. I really like pixel graphics, unlike Street Fighter Six, which you know looks like Fortnite. But again, teach their own, right? I wish the D-pad was a little bit bigger. But, uh... Round two, fight. But still, though, and, I mean, and the first like battles are going to be pretty cheese. You know, that's what they did. Like usually, like the first one or two battles are like super easy. So that then you know, then once you get to the third, the third character, then they make it. Then they make it impossible, <laughs> right? Which is the idea. Um, so now let's go ahead. Let's dive into Street Fighter Two Alpha. Let's dive into the second one. And uh, see how it compares to this one. So here we go. Alpha 2? Trying to think. This I might be the, the least unfamiliar with. I don't know. Oh, wait a second. Okay, maybe. I'll, I'll have to see. I'm going to take a look at the third one. Yeah, okay. So they definitely increased the roster a lot. Man. Again, be Ryu for consistency, manual, all the same stuff. They want turbo. Yeah, so right, okay. I'm thinking right off the bat, and kind of what I was saying earlier, why would you want to go back to the first alpha? Because <laughs> you already get a bigger roster, right? Like, this looks like it's the same game with improvements. You know, so it's just kind of like, see if I can get it perfect. It helps if I actually press the right button there. Oh, you're better for getting it perfect. Okay, oh. Yeah, I could, uh, so I could already see kind of like the same thing with the Street Fighter uh, hyper fighting, right? I, I, I would preferably play that one. Now, fundamentally, these are two different games, different set of roster and all that. Um, so I look at, you know, like hyper fighting and championship edition, like in its own, like it's in Sony Universe. Like those two are essentially like the same type of game. 
just for different improvements. Again, this is my opinion. Um, so I would, you know, for me, I would consider like, you know, hyper fighting and championship edition one game. So far, I'm considering Alpha 2 and Alpha 1 one game, meaning I'm going to play Alpha 2 over Alpha 1, and I'm going to play Hyper Fighting over Champion. Unless there's just, like, nostalgia that you have where you have to go back and play that version of the game, and I totally get that. But, I mean, definitely, though. I mean, if you love Street Fighter, yeah, this is cool. This is cool. Hadouken. And these are just the default like settings, by the way. <laughs> I didn't like change anything. I am really not this good. I think it might be easier. <laughs> but not yeah. After this, we'll play the third alpha, and then that'll definitely you know give me like a bigger like a bigger picture. Yeah. All right. Let's go ahead and we'll load up alpha three, and we'll see how that compares to alpha one and two. All right, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Let's go. Let's go. Born to fight. Ooh, I love this intro sequence. And now we're gonna see. Let's we'll take a look at the roster. I bet it's I bet it's increased even more. Like this being in the arcade and like like walking by this machine and seeing this, like, how could you not want to play it? Let's insert a credit. Wow! See, like, look at this. Like, even like, even like a bigger roster of characters, right? So from that, <laughs> I guess I'll keep being Ryu for consistency. This is, of course, other characters I want to play. Oh yeah. Okay. Yes, this is the one I'm more familiar with. This is the one. I think I remember playing on Dreamcast because you get like the different whatever the different isms, different attack styles. Yeah. Ryu is a man following the path to become a true martial artist. What is the meaning of the evil energy building within him? Uh, <laughs> all right, let's go, let's go. He's, he's got to release his evil energy. I think we all have, like, evil energy we have to release. <laughs> yeah, this has, like, yeah, the isms, that's right. And I don't know if I'm making it up that on, like, the Dreamcast version, you could pause and you could look at the characters, like, special moves. Unless I did that like in a Wikipedia or something, but oh, a there we go, Dragon Punch. Wow. Yeah, this like, why would you want to go back to Alpha One or Two again? Unless for nostalgia. So this is like Alpha Three is what Street Fighter Two Turbo. Turbo is a champion. Like, it's the same game. But like they've made improvements, right? Like the characters look just like oh, like it's drawn like just like that much better. There's a bigger roster. It still plays like just as fluid. Yeah, yeah this is cool. Yeah, if, if I if I had the alpha, I'm playing I'm playing this and I'm playing Street Fighter 2 Turbo. Because they're fundamentally two different games in the Street Fighter universe. Like they're they're different. They're very they're very different enough. Very, very different enough. Awesome. Alrighty, let's go ahead. I well, let's do, we'll do we'll do one more. We can do one more battle. Do one more battle before we before we move on to uh, uh, Super Street Fighter Puzzle Turbo. Go for it, man! Yeah, this just this just feels so much more like arcadey than the other versions. That makes sense, right? Like, this is just this is incredible. Yeah, I remember why people like really like the series. I still like a Street Fighter Third Strike better, but again, that's that's me. If this wasn't out on Dream, if this was not out on Dreamcast, then it was a. Uh, then it was strike, third strike that I was playing, and then this I was playing, you know, like in a like emulator, obviously. But, you know, other than playing it in the real arcade, but <laughs> I didn't. I mean, I'm not gonna. I didn't play like these versions as much as I did like the other, like you know, Street Fighter, like OG Street Fighter Two, and a Mortal Kombat. Oh man, I got my butt kicked. Yeah, 
Yeah, we'll see if Puzzle Fighter is like a variant enough because it's like, all right, I'm sick of playing. I'm sick of playing Street Fighter, <laughs> and that's why I kind of, I kind of feel like you're only really gonna. There's only really gonna be two Street Fighter games you're gonna play. You're gonna play this, and you're gonna play Turbo, and then you have one more game. Okay, okay. Let's go ahead and check out Super Street Fighter Puzzle, and um, and after that, we'll wrap up with final thoughts. Super. So I get to the full zip of the games. Super Puzzle Fighter 2 Turbo. Man, that's a... <laughs> that's a mouthful. All right, so this, I don't really remember playing. So this might be the first time playing this game. I, I might have briefly played a PlayStation version of the first one of this. I don't know. This is the computer. I guess it'll be normal. Ah! Oh, cool. You could even play, like, the Vampire Hunter characters. Well, there's Ryu. Done with it. She did still so ready. What? Okay, yeah. It looks a lot like it's like columns. It feels like it. Oh, crap, was I supposed to stack these? Okay, I was supposed to stack these. I'm like, yeah. Uh oh, first attack. Crap. I know where to put this. Go. See if we can do something here. What? How many of these do you have to have? Oh, do you have to have one of those like fiery like anuses there? Let's see. Yes, you do. Yeah, man. Okay. Yep. And then there's like a special move. That that is pretty cool. You know, that makes it feel very like arcadey. Oh, that was so stupid of me. What the hell did I do that? Right, let's put this one here. Okay, so if you match them all together, it makes it go off. So, like, if I do this... Yeah. Pff, crap. Ooh! If I do this... Yeah! Alright, alright, alright. Two chain. Although I will say that, like... I don't really have a chance to like look over at my character because <laughs> I'm like, I, you know, I need to play it. Okay, I'm getting the hang of this. This is actually kind of cool. Is that like a bomb? What are you trying to do? What are you trying to do? What, then they're just gonna like explode in the crap? Yeah, so even if you have two. Even if you have two blocks, it kind of makes it disappear. All right, all right. No, I'm, I'm, I'm digging this. I'm digging this. This is actually pretty cool. Now I'm kind of wishing we had more games like this on here. Like, I know this is a Street Fighter cab, but they're on, like, they're on, like, a shooter or something else. Will this be enough just to come back and play all these games once you've, like, your Street Fighter to death? You know, out over it. <laughs> oh, I fight Ken. Yeah, we'll play. We'll play another match here. Yeah, this is definitely like different than what I'm what I'm used to in a puzzle game. But see now I can do this? Okay. I'll make the fireball go there. Yeah, let's see place this. Attack. That's gonna be a waste of okay, Let me make this also puff out. I'm gonna do this. Let me see. Oh, that, that's hilarious. It just forms right there. Crap. Uh oh. I'm in trouble, folks. Oh, I did. Uh, I did super derp ten thousand right there. 
This is not looking good, everyone. No, no, no. Okay, can I dive into this? Yeah! But yeah, take that, Hadouken. Alright, now we're gonna do this. Yeah, that's so weird, though, that I didn't... Oh, there we go, now I attacked him. Yeah. <laughs> okay, okay. I'm still winning, I'm still winning. I do love me my puzzle games like this, so this is... Oh, this will be the finishing blow. <laughs> Yeah, Super Hanuki. Take that, and take that. Oh, come on, the computer's like barely like hanging in there. Like, really? Dude, how's the computer still hanging in there? Warning on what? Oh, really? You're gonna throw that crap at me? Oh my god, see this, like the computer's not like cheating, like really? Oh, this is donkey balls. This is beyond stupid. You're not gonna get me. Like... The computer is trying to get my last credit. Like, really? KO! Alright, 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 alright. Very cool. Yeah, let's go ahead and let's go and let, let's wrap up and give my final thoughts. So, final thoughts on all this. Alrighty. So yeah, I really, I really enjoyed uh, playing all those games. Again, it's the biggest crime is that we can't get Capcom carts to play in anything. Um... So I was just reviewing these games, strictly playing one player, even though you will be able to plug in a controller and play co-op. Let's face it, folks, a lot of us as adults will be playing this one player with only online capability. Or perhaps you have more friends than I do and have people over. And then again, um, I can't tell you, you know, how does this compare using uh, the built-in controls, using the sound wall buttons, or like being able to play on that smaller screen, so there's no HDMI output. So this, my, my first initial thoughts has just strictly been, Playing all the games in the next box controller, right? Just, just focusing on the games. So let's kind of do a quick recap. So we have your Street Fighter 2 Champion and your Street Fighter 2 Turbo. And yeah, I stand by what I say that those, those are in the same Street Fighter universe, right? The mechanics like feel the same. They look the same. But uh, the Super Street Fighter 2 Turbo is definitely the upgraded better version, in my opinion. You know, it's 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 faster. And there's other like very like minor changes. Like I think that's one of... Chun Li got her fireball and all that. It is a little bit more challenging, but in theory, um, we should have access to the dip switches on the Evercade Alpha, like you, you know, like you would right now on the actual machine itself, because Blaze said those updates are coming. So you could eventually make it easier. But yeah, if I owned the Evercade Alpha and I was going to play this, I would have no reason to go and play Championship Edition. There's no online play. There's no high score. There's no, there, for my opinion, unless like a, a buddy were to come over and say, "Hey, I specifically want to play you in Championship Edition." No. I'm not going to play that. I'm always going to go back to hyper fighting because for me, it's the better upgraded version of the game. So really, um, that's subtract one game, right? So really, you have, you've got one of the OG Street Fighter games that you're going to play, at least in my opinion. Then we have the Alpha series, right? And kind of going through and playing those, like Alpha, very different, different Street Fighter universe. You have, you know, similar characters and a lot of different characters. And then, of course, you have the meter that charges up to do special moves. So definitely, like... I could see going back and playing Street Fighter 2 Turbo instead of this, because they're totally two different games. It doesn't feel just like an upgraded version of the game, Alpha. It's, it feels like a complete new version of Street Fighter. However, as when I played Alpha 1 and I played Alpha 2 and I played Alpha 3, the roster kept growing bigger, bigger, <laughs> and, and, and bigger. And, you know, everything, like the graphics looked a little bit more polished and fluid. I, I love the way the characters are drawn even more in Alpha 3. So I feel the same way that I do about... Street Fighter 2 Turbo and Championship Edition, and unless I had a buddy come over specifically looking to play Alpha 1 and 2, I don't have nostalgia for specifically for just Alpha 1 and 2. For the Alpha series, yes. So I'm always going to play 3. I'm definitely going, you know, I'm always going to play 3 over 1 and 2 after I've checked them out. So right there, in my opinion, we have 6 games, and now we're down to 2 games because of that. And then the third one, Super Street Fighter Puzzle... Let me actually look at it! Um, Super Puzzle Fighter 2 Turbo. That's a mouthful. Um, yeah, that that's great. That's 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 something that's something different. You know that there's no other uh, game on here that, that that's like that. So that's really the third game. I could definitely see going back and playing that many times. Lots of replay. I, I love me my Tetris. You know, I, I do, <laughs> I do love me my puzzle games and all that. Uh, but is that just enough on, on its own just to get an alpha? So really, you only have three games, uh, in my opinion. Um, when I reviewed the Mega Man, you know the. <laughs> 
yeah, yeah, I, I kind of thought at least you know you did kind of have like six unique unique games. If you consider the two Mega Man's to be one, that's still like like at least five games. So I don't know. I, I feel with this one that we're shortchanged. Uh, I think what, what would have made this great is if they went ahead and they took out the Championship Edition, threw on like Magic Sword or something, or like threw on there like another like another shooter, and maybe just took out like Alpha One and kept Alpha Two and Three. I think that's what's really missing uh, from the from this collection. The fact that it really only feels like three games. And don't get me wrong, I I love I love Street Fighter. I really I really do. But if you're getting this just for like for the variety of games, I think the Mega Man one is you know that would be my preferred choice. Uh, but if you're really wanting to play Street Fighter specifically in this format and you like the looks, sure go ahead and get Alpha Two. But without online play or an ease of a second player, now kind of going through this, I do like Puzzle Fighter, but. When I went ahead and I I played through the Mega Man games, and the reason I and this is the reason I wanted to do a first look at that first is that I felt like there was more value game wise. There's more variety. I could see myself coming back to that. Versus this, yeah, you just kind of got a couple of Street Fighters, and then it's kind of like, really, uh, are you going to be in the mood to play Super Street Fighter, or would you rather just play Alpha Three? So then, kind of depending how you look at it, maybe you only have two or three games on this. Um, so there you go. That's that, that's kind of what I what I think of this. I guess my definitive edition is based upon the games only. I'm going to go for the Mega Man if I'm going to get this as much as I love Street Fighter because of the capabilities and all that. And if you want to show your love and appreciation and that you watch this video all the way to the end, go ahead and put in the comments, Super Street Fighter Monkey Boy. Go ahead and put Super Street Fighter Monkey Boy in the comments below. Let me know that you've watched the whole video to the end and all that and if you happen to stumble here through the youtube verse please consider subscribing it really helps the channel out uh, we're continuing to grow the next goal is 2000 subs we have memberships i have a p.o box all that stuff will be uh, in the description below and uh, just to let you know my channel members have already gone ahead and most likely watch this video i'll try to put out videos earlier when i can and i'm gonna go ahead and thank my channel members thank you so much everyone for watching and bye bye Thanks, Crash Line, Mr. Shua, Immortal Surgeon, Sucker MC, Ember Cummings, Joe Whitlash!